Patrick, welcome to the club. Um, how does it feel to be a City player? Uh, no, it's a, it's a great feeling. I mean, uh, I've always wanted to play for a big club. I mean, City's huge in England and worldwide, as you can see. So, yeah, I mean, it was a, it's a dream come true to finally sign and get out here. And how easy was the decision to make when you found that City were interested? Uh, well, it's, it wasn't the easiest because, obviously, I'm, I live in London and it just means coming to Manchester. But then, when you think about the club, I mean, the Premier League, I mean, it, then it gets, gets easier after a while to think about it. And there's a few familiar faces here to help you feel welcome as well. Yeah, yeah. Um, I know uh, Brandon and Angus from uh, England. And uh, I was on the way with Fabian. So Fabian's nice and Joe and uh, Richard and Raheem. So they've all been welcoming me to the team, really. And have you been made to feel welcome here in the first yeah. few days? Every, all the staff, players, security, everyone. It's been lovely to me when I've come, so it's good. It's a good start. So when you were back in, in Manchester, did you get the chance to look around the yeah. City Football Academy? Yeah, I looked at the old stadium, yeah. Um, Gary took me around, so took me and my family around, and it was, a, it was unbelievable. I mean, it's the best I've seen ever. And which players are you particularly looking forward to training alongside? Obviously, you get a chance to train with the first team as well. Uh, the likes of Yaya Toure, Nazari, David Silva's might be my favourite player for in the Premier League. So, yeah, to play, play with him would be a dream, really, yeah. And just for, for people who aren't, haven't seen you play before, what, how would you describe your playing style? Uh, it's quick, attackive, positive. I mean, I love to just run, beat people, so... And uh, could you just give us a brief walk through your career so far? Um, when I was 13, I, uh, well, I had a few trials when I was younger with uh, some London clubs and uh, they really didn't take me on. And then 13, I went and trial at Fulham and they took me in. And then through, since then, I've been kicking on. And about two seasons ago, I made my debut in the Premier League, so which against Man City, actually, yeah. Yeah, I was just going to ask you about that. Yeah. Um, it's quite a funny little circular. Exactly, yeah. But yeah, it was... It all went so quick. I mean, was only there five years, but yeah, I'm glad to be here now. And can you just talk us through your debut at City? Could you talk us through the game and what you were feeling beforehand? Uh, well, the manager was at the start was going to start me. He came to the dressing room and uh, came to me and said, uh, I was thinking about starting you up front. I was a bit shocked about that, really. And then uh, as the game got on, 60 minutes, I came on, which was unbelievable in the stadium, all them fans. I mean gave you an insight of what could happen, could be, you know, and uh, no, I enjoyed the moment, enjoyed the game, unless we lost 5-0, but <laughs> I still enjoyed it. But at youth level, you've had more joy against at City, um, yeah, and yeah. if I remember one particular FA Youth Cup game that you Yeah, went, we played at uh, Oldham, and we won 3-1, which, uh, and then we went on to, to the final, fortunately lose, but yeah, it was a great game, that. You get the prospect to train with um, Patrick Vieira as well, could you just talk yeah. about what it's going to be like? That's... I mean, I've played against Patrick Sides a few times now. I mean, he's a legend for Arsenal and for City, so yeah, it'd be good to see him work with him as well. You say you know Angus and, and Brandon from England. Did you speak to them at all before deciding to come here? Or? Uh, no, not really. I mean, City's been in my mind for quite a, quite a while now, and I, I knew what I really wanted. So, uh, no, they, I know a few of the other lads from the under-18s as well. They, everyone gave good reviews of the club, so, I mean, yeah, it's good, good feeling, yeah. Yeah, and lots have been you know, written about you know, price tags and, and things like that. You can't let that affect you, though. That's just a bad no, thing, no, I guess. No, that won't affect me at all. I mean, I know what the truth is, you know, and, um, but that doesn't bother me at all. I just want to play my football and get on with it. Uh, a good season for you in the upcoming season? Uh, well, first of all, to play for the club, that's, uh, that's the number one target you've got, you've got to maintain. I mean, to play for the club, play at the stadium yet yet and then continue to play that would be the next step and then just play for a few years and carry on playing and playing and playing it's the main goal for me really